me Ishmael. I go to sea as a simple sailor, right before the mast, plumb down into the forecastle, aloft there to the royal masthead. I am tormented with an everlasting itch for things remote. I love to sail forbidden seas and to land on barbarous coasts. For these reasons, the whaling voyage was welcome. The great floodgates of the wonder world swung open. There floated in my inmost soul endless processions of the whale and of one grand hooded phantom <coughs> like a snow hill in the sky. <laughs>
Jacob's father was a high chief, a king, his uncle a high priest. There was excellent blood in his veins, royal stuff. It was quite plain that he must be some abominable savage. But Queequeg was a creature in a transitory state, neither caterpillar nor butterfly. Savage though he was, and hideously marred about the face, his countenance yet had something in it. Through all his unearthly tattooings, <coughs> and in his large, deep eyes, fiery, black, and bold, there seems tokens of a spirit that would dare a thousand devils. Thank you. 
as I leveled my glance towards the taff rail, foreboding shivers ran over me. Captain Ahab stood on his quarter deck. So powerfully did the whole grim aspect of Ahab affect me that for the first few moments I hardly noted the barbaric leg upon which he partly stood. Stand by me now. 